Hey there Internet, Mitchell here at Redwater Dodge, home of the $10 oil change and rig ready Rams. Today we're going to be looking at one of our newest trucks. It is a 2020 Ram 1500 in beautiful granite crystal. It has the 22 inch sport rims wrapped in the Goodyear Eagle Touring tires. It has the paint match bumpers obviously with the sport appearance package. It also has front and rear park sensors and the black badging. Uh, paint match the cowl here around the button to open the tailgate. It auto dampens. It also has the spray and bed liner which is pretty handy if you're going to actually use your truck as a truck. Down the side of the truck here you have the LED tail lights. They actually have a amber signal light in these which makes it a little bit uh, easier to see at night. Uh, push to open fuel door here with the capless fueling. This truck also has the six foot four bed in it which is uh, a little bit handier if you're going to be hauling stuff in it. Paint match door handles. It also has the proximity entry here so if you uh, push this button with the key in your pocket it will lock the doors. And if you just grab it with the key in your pocket, the doors will unlock, which is pretty handy. This one also has the tow mirrors on it with the uh, in-mirror signal light. Uh, LED headlights, LED fog lights, LED signal lights. All of the lights in this truck are LED. It also has the paint match grill in it with the black Ram logo there. Uh, front park sensors, as previously mentioned as well. Uh, this truck has the Rebel appearance scoop for the hood, which uh, gives you these two extra louvers here. We'll open the hood up and look at the 5.7 liter Hemi, making 395 horsepower and 410 foot-pounds of torque. Close that up and look down the passenger side of the truck here and you will see that there is no antenna, gives it, giving it a very clean body line. They moved that up to the roof. Uh, we'll go inside and we'll check it out. The interior of this truck is very nice. It has the premium leather seating with the nice perforations there in the center for the heated and cooled seats. So in the summer, it'll keep your butt nice and cold. And in the winter, it'll keep it nice and warm for you. It also has a heated steering wheel up here, uh, leather wrapped center console with the embossed RAM logo there. Tons of storage in here with the uh, USB charger back there so you can plug your phone in. It also has a little uh, channel here so you can run the cord through so it keeps the uh, closing feature there. Uh, has a max fill line down here so you can uh, know how high you can fill it and still have the function of the sliding portion here in the center. Uh, flip up divider there so nothing comes flying from the front into the back when you are uh, racing. Uh, tons of storage up here. You have your change slots here as well. Two cup holders. Push this button. The center portion slides back and you have a uh, power outlet down here like you'd have in your house. Uh, 400 watt, 115 volt of uh, alternating current. You have your uh, cell phone holder here as well with your USB and USB-C ports here above it. There's also an auxiliary port. You can turn your front and rear park sense off with the push of a button there as well. So if you're pulling into your garage, you click the front one off and it won't yell at you when you are uh, getting close to your wall. Uh, if you're pulling a trailer, you click your back one off and it will not yell at you when you're backing up your trailer. Tow haul mode, uh, traction control. You have your built-in trailer brake controller here as well. 12-inch uh, Uconnect screen. You can actually set these up so that uh, media is up there on the top and your comfort controls are here on the bottom, which is pretty neat. The nav feature in the 12-inch screen is very nice. It's very big, very easy to see. You can also change the colors of it too if you go into your nav settings and then go to your map appearance, which is pretty cool. Uh, you have your controls for all your heated vented seats, heated wheel. You can deploy your power steps there as well. You can go back to your backup camera through here also. Uh, backup camera is incredibly clear. You also have a zoom feature so you can look at the actual trailer ball from your, uh, if you're hooking up to a trailer, it makes it a lot easier. You also have redundant controls down the side for your uh, dual climate controls and all your fan speed and everything, your AC, your defrost for your mirrors and back window. Uh, for those of you that run the uh, radar detectors or the dash cameras, before they only had the power plugs down here in the center console, but now they actually put one up on the dash so you can only have a cord running the eight inches or so there instead of having one all the way down here and getting in the way which is pretty nice. This truck also has the Harman Kardon audio system in it, which is uh, which is actually the best audio system that we offer. A uh, 19 speaker system. A lot of people do like that. Or you can get the Alpine 2 or the Ram one. Uh, gauge cluster controls are here on the left hand side of the wheel as well as the uh, hands-free phone controls. Your uh, <coughs> cruise control settings are here on the right as well as your gear limiter. So if you're pulling a trailer, you lock it in a certain gear and it'll take that hill a little bit easier. Uh, your power adjustable pedals are here uh, beside your left knee as well as the electronic parking brake. See this truck they carry through with the same nice leather a lot of other manufacturers will chintz out back here because they know that it will not be used every day but ram does uh, have your back they carry through with the same nice leather they have a flip down center console here as well with the also leather wrapped uh two cup holders here two cup holders here as well as the two up front so you have six in the center as well as one on each door so you have 10 cup holders in a vehicle that fits five people so each of you could have two drinks which is pretty cool uh flip the seat up tons of storage down here they actually got rid of the transmission tunnel in these trucks so they have a massive flat load surface back here. And as well for 2019, 2020 model year, they lengthened the cab four inches. So there's a ton of legroom back here, like a lot of legroom back here. 
Uh, USB, USB-C ports up here as well. They have a little cubby. Another power outlet here so you can plug a charger into it perhaps. The uh, rear vents for the rear seat passengers so you're not melting them in the uh, summer or freezing them in the winter. Flip up the RAM floor mats here and you have the RAM bin, which is pretty cool. A lot of people like that. Tons of storage in there. They also have the removable liner. Uh, you can also cut these little holes out here so you can have your tie-down points sticking through if you want the straps swing down in your back seat. They also have the uh, hooks here so you can hook a bag and hook your grocery bags into them so they're not tumbling across your back seat when you're driving around. You can also flip this out, get a little more under the seat storage so you can kind of hide when you flip the seat down, which is pretty awesome. They also have the panoramic roof in this truck, which is massive and uh, provides a lot of natural lighting in here. If you don't like the uh, light coming in, you can close this little sunshade. You can also open this front portion, it slides back on top of the rear portion, so you do have the sunroof uh, function of it as well. You can also vent it, which is nice. They have the power sliding rear window in this truck as well. With the Harman Kardon audio system, you get the two speakers back here as well. The uh, rear airbag can deploy over your back window, so it's a little bit safer as well. Uh, tons of rear seat uh, storage behind the front seats as well. So guys, if you're interested in this 2020 Ram 1500, you can email us at sales at Redwater Dodge. Call us 780-942-3629, or better yet, you can come on in.